The virus can be spread when an infected person coughs or sneezes. Hand washing is a first line of defense. How is the coronavirus spread? The Wuhan coronavirus outbreak is a new illness and scientists are still assessing how it spreads from person to person, but similar viruses tend to spread via cough and sneeze droplets. When an infected person coughs or sneezes, they release droplets of saliva or mucus. These droplets can fall on people in the vicinity and can be either directly inhaled or picked up on the hands then transferred when someone touches their face, causing infection. For flu, some hospital guidelines define exposure as being within six feet of an infected person who sneezes or coughs for 10 minutes or longer. Viruses can also be spread through droplets landing on surfaces such as seats on buses or trains or desks in school. However, whether this is a main transmission route depends on how long viruses survive on surfaces, this can vary from hours to months. There is anecdotal evidence that the virus can be spread by people before they have symptoms. Some other illnesses such as flu can be passed from one person to another before symptoms occur, but the extent to which this is happening with the Wuhan coronavirus is not well understood yet. How to protect yourself and others Wash your hands, wet your hands with clean, running water and apply soap. Lather your hands, including the backs, between your fingers, and under your nails and scrub for at least 20 seconds. Rinse. Cover your mouth and nose with a tissue when you cough or sneeze, then throw the tissue in the bin and wash your hands. If you do not have a tissue to hand, cough or sneeze into your elbow rather than your hands. Face masks offer some protection as they block liquid droplets. However, they do not block smaller aerosol particles that can pass through the material of the mask. The masks also leave the eyes exposed and there is evidence that some viruses can infect a person through the eyes. Seek early medical help if you have a fever, cough and difficulty breathing, and share your travel history with healthcare providers. If visiting live markets in affected areas avoid direct, unprotected contact with live animals and surfaces that have been in contact with animals. If you are in an affected area avoid eating raw or undercooked animal products and exercise care when handling raw meat, milk or animal organs to avoid cross-contamination with uncooked foods. If you have returned from an affected area in China in the last two weeks, stay indoors and avoid contact with other people for 14 days. This means not going to work, school or public areas. If you have returned from an infected area and develop a high temperature, cough, runny nose, sore throat or difficulty breathing do not leave your home until you have been given advice by a doctor. The novel coronavirus, which started in the Chinese city of Wuhan, has so far killed 362 people. 17,384 people have contracted the disease, including two in the UK, with 2,298 believed to be critical. But what is novel coronavirus, what are the symptoms to look out for and how exactly does the disease spread? Experts in China carry out work on a new coronavirus nucleic acid detention kit. What is novel coronavirus? Novel coronaviruses are a large family of viruses that can cause infections ranging from the common cold to severe acute respiratory syndrome SARS. The virus attacks the respiratory system, causing pneumonia like lung lesions. Some of the virus types cause less serious disease, while others, like the one that caused Middle East Respiratory Syndrome MERS, are far more severe. In 2003 an outbreak of a similar virus SARS, killed more than 900 around the world within weeks. What are the symptoms? Symptoms are similar to a common cold. They include, a runny nose headache, cough fever shortness of breath chills body aches in most cases, you won't know whether you have a coronavirus or a different cold causing virus, such as rhinovirus. But if a coronavirus infection spreads to the lower respiratory tract, your windpipe and your lungs, it can cause pneumonia, especially in older people, people with heart disease or those with weakened immune systems. There is no vaccine for coronavirus. To help prevent infection, do the same things you do to avoid the common cold such as using alcohol-based antibacterial soaps and sprays. People should also avoid touching their eyes, nose, and mouth, and avoid contact with people who are infected. A coronavirus infection should be treated the same way a cold is treated. How does coronavirus spread? Coronavirus is an airborne virus, spread in a similar way to colds and the flu. It is incredibly contagious and is spread through contact with anything the virus is on as well as infected breath, coughs or sneezes. 
This means that anyone who is infected can pass it into any surface or person they breathe on or touch. How far has the virus spread so far? In spite of efforts to contain the virus, it has gone international. There have been 17,384 cases reported worldwide. 2,298 are believed to be critical. Japan, Thailand, Singapore, South Korea, Australia, Taiwan, Malaysia, US, Germany, Vietnam, France, UAE, Canada, Italy, UK, India, Philippines, Russia, Cambodia, Finland, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Spain and Sweden have all reported cases. On January 31, 2020, the first two cases were reported in the UK. How many people have died from coronavirus? The global death toll currently stands at 362. In China, the majority of those deaths were all in the central province of Hubei. Thanks for watching plays like share and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. Thanks for watching plays like share and subscribe our channel for more amazing videos.